Hi, I'm Tom from Take Time to Travel. Today I'm at Victoria's Public Market, which is inside the beautiful Hudson Building. Construction of the Georgian Revival style Hudson Bay store began in 1913. Since then, the bay has moved out and Victoria's Public Market opened in 2013 as a unique indoor shopping destination. The Public Market has a trendy industrial feel with high ceilings, exposed concrete and ductwork. When I went, it was decorated for Valentine's Day. There are lots of shops and restaurants featuring a diverse range of farm fresh, locally sourced artisan foods and local goods. Let's go eat. I started at Victoria Pie Co, which specializes in baking sweet and savory pastries from local ingredients. Everything in the display case looked mouth-watering. It features an open kitchen, so you can see how the food is prepared if you want. We got the chicken pot pie with Cowichan Valley chicken, butter, cream sauce and veggies, as well as the Italian veggie hand pie with spinach and feta, as well as the steak and mushroom pie with caramelized onions, potatoes, peas, herbs and gravy. The chicken pot pie was absolutely packed with chicken and it tasted phenomenal. The Italian veggie hand pie was also fully stuffed, as was the steak and mushroom pie. Everything was excellent. Just across from Victoria Pie Co. is the roast meat and sandwich shop. They have their carving station on display with delicious porchetta, roast beef and bacon. We had the chicken bowl with roasted vegetables and roast potatoes, as well as the roast beef sandwich with onion jam and chimichurri sauce. Both choices were wonderful. Besides the many restaurants, there are also shops like this one called Whisk, which sells kitchen supplies and accessories. For the vegetarians and vegans, there's Shatterbox Coffee Company. It's a hip industrial spot for coffee, tea, hot chocolate, as well as soup and baked goods. We got the hot chocolate, a cheese scone, a chai latte, and an oatmeal raisin cookie. What a great way to start off the day. There's also the Very Good Butchers, which is a vegan deli featuring organic, plant-based meat alternatives and a hot food menu. We ordered the cauliflower wings in a Thai sweet chili sauce and the Very Big Mac burger, which is huge. It comes with two, two and a half ounce patties, cheese with a Z, iceberg lettuce, onions, and a triple stacked sesame bun. Look at the size of it. The patties are massive. You could easily split this with someone else. This place was one of my favorites in Victoria so far. We also tried Vic Express Teriyaki and Roll, which is a Japanese restaurant with other Asian offerings. They also offer specialty sweets and packaged goods. We ordered the beef yakisoba, and the daily special, the Korean fried chicken, which came with a salad and a pop. Both were tasty. Inside the Victoria Public Market, there's also this cool specialty chocolate shop, as well as this fresh produce market, and other vendors. Victoria's Public Market is a pretty cool spot. If you haven't been there already, I suggest you check it out. It's definitely worth the trip. Especially very good butchers. Their food was amazing, it's vegan and vegetarian, and it's not crazy expensive. That's not something you see very often. I really enjoyed making today's video. I hope you enjoyed watching it too. If you did, I'd appreciate it if you would like, subscribe, and hit the bell for notifications on my future videos. And remember, 
take time to travel. Catch you on the next one.